Welcome to this demonstration showcasing EMC's backup and recovery technologies for Microsoft Exchange and SharePoint Server. This demonstration is one in a series of demos as part of an EMC proven solution which also includes white paper providing technical design guidance, deployment and performance test results. This particular demonstration cover deleting and restoring a single file in an active SharePoint form in a quick and simple fashion from a deduplicated backup using Avmar version 6. SharePoint granular single item restore using Avmar 6 and crawl on track power controls. The first thing we're doing in this video is finding a single document and we can view the process of this document. It's a sample text file called a.txt and it's in a subsite in a folder and now we're going to delete that document so as you can see it's no longer in that folder So we go to our backup, we choose the correct day and backup number from the right server. We browse in point form, content database that the document was in. We restore it to a different using slash, that means Z drive. We choose a granular restore and we choose for that mount point to be mounted for two hours. Now in Activity Monitor we can see the restore is running and we can see it complete. It should only take a few seconds. So we can see that the Z drive is mounted with the different servers involved in different backups and the SQL server is there so we open on track power controls which is integrated into Evermore Granular Restore choose the content DB that has a, contains that document choose the log file that belongs to that content DB choose the correct site collection in the SharePoint form Now crawl is scanning, pre-scanning, hashing and reading the contents of the content database. You can see the source field on top and the target. The source is what is read from the backup content database. And we're going into that folder and the target currently in SharePoint in that site collection and in that folder. So we're going to sort it by leaf name since it's a.txt it should be at the top and we see it's missing in the SharePoint site so we drag it and we drop it into the folder and crawl then restores that single document. The restore is done and now we can go back into SharePoint and check that the document is there. And there it is. Thank you for watching this video as part of a series of videos for the solution. We invite you to view the other videos relating to the solution. You can also download the white paper that contains the extensive test data and other very useful information relating to backup and restore of Microsoft Exchange and SharePoint to Avamar and Data Domain.